just say that uh, very disappointing uh, for myself, for us as, uh, as an offensive football team. Uh, I think that's pretty obvious. <clears throat> Simply because of the uh, fact that uh, we put a big emphasis going all the way back to spring practice uh, on uh, not making mistakes as far as uh, the penalties, uh, throwing and catching the ball with a high percentage, which we didn't do, uh, and creating big plays, which we didn't do. Uh, and those are probably the big three things that stand out in my mind. So uh, very disappointed, uh, but we will, uh, we will show up tomorrow, go back to work with the idea of uh, moving forward and uh, making the corrections that need to be made. It's a tough game. I thought Western came to play. You know, we've got to convert on uh, on our offensive positions. We've got too many positions that we're getting the ball around the 50 or 40 or whatever it was, and not converting that into points. So we've got to be able to do that. And um, I thought we ran the ball okay. Lack of explosive plays, I guess, is what I would say in terms of um, you know you just can't. It's, it's very difficult to go four, five, three, four, five all the way down the football field. You've got to come up with an explosive play. So we've got opportunities, we've got balls in the air, we've got opportunities to catch the football, we've got to catch the football. It's not something we've seen in, in summer camp, so we can be straightened out. And, um, you know, as we move, move through it, we can't make mistakes to beat ourselves. So the thing that we worry about in the first game, unforced stairs, we have. We have. We had a snap over our guy's head, we had a snap on the ground to our punter, things that haven't happened, and, uh, and we had some offsides penalties and things of that nature. So we've got to clean those things up. But, at the end of the day, the goal is to win, and we've got to win. So, uh, you know, from that standpoint, goal number one accomplished. What we've got to do is clean up things. And obviously, and I credit Western Michigan, so I don't say this in any disrespect to them, but, but we had too many other opportunities to put the game away and to, uh, and to get up. Uh, yeah, it's very disappointing, but, you know, we, took some, we had some positive plays in there. We got to continue to make the play and be there for the quarterback, but, you know, we had some positives in there. You know, Jairus gets a pick and pitches it back to Curtis, and Curtis scores. I mean, Curtis Drummond has, I mean, if that ain't in the top ten on ESPN all weekend, I don't know what is. It probably should be the number one play in the country, I think. That was an unbelievable catch. And